and welcome Take fam back to Pokemon Planet the MMO. So here we are after the Easter event and I got a whole bunch of little goodies to open up so we're gonna see what we got. First one is we got 189 Easter eggs. I didn't get 200. I would have liked that. Um, let's see here. Let's make the chat a little bit bigger. Um, if I can find that perfect spot there we are so I'm doing this just so that we can it'll show us what we get as we do it so um, let's get going so first one we got a bunch of pokeballs potions more potions and you'll notice that this is the vast majority of what you get which is okay because while a lot of people are always you know, are pretty toxic about getting pokeballs and potions and all that kind of stuff um, fastball, the Pokeball, all the Pokeballs end up becoming useful. They have a use, okay? All the potions and revives, okay, we got a Calcium. That's, that's pretty good to use. It raises some stats of stuff. Um, but as I was saying, so all the potions, so the next time there's an event, or you're farming someplace where there usually isn't a PC, or I mean, you don't have the access to a Pokemon Center where you can just heal, or in one of those events when people don't pop up a PC every hour so you don't have one. This is how you continue your farming. You use all your potions. Okay, we got a bike voucher. Oh, that's kind of cool. Um, we got... The other thing that we got was we got another TM box. Okay. Let's see. Moon ball. Oh. Okay, we got world blessings. I don't need to use any of those right now. There's one already going. All right, let's keep on going. Hyper potions, potions, dive ball, casino tokens, lure ball, EV reset, 10 pokeballs, three revive, max revives, one EV reset, six pokeballs, potions, Ultra Balls, Potions, Repeat Ball, Potions, Poke Balls, Lure Ball, oh, lots and lots of balls, a Zinc, that's kind of cool, lots and lots of potions, more potions, and so we continue. Currently at 140, got Max Revives, Ultra Balls, Pokeballs. So this is the culmination of all of my Easter eggs from the entire Easter event, okay? We got a Protein, another TM box, another TM box. So a lot of people were always like, oh, they're, the Easter eggs are horrible. It's not worth farming. Well, right here, me opening all of these, like, like I said, this was me farming it for two weeks straight, World Blessing. And... This is to prove to everybody that while a bunch of casino tokens and EV reset, while it may seem infantile or pointless, it is not. And I did not purchase any of these. I went, I just straight up farmed, I was grinding, I was trying to catch Pokemon that were rare in the area, E-rare, stuff like that. We did catch quite a few of them, and I'll probably be doing a giveaway with some of them when, uh, I guess they're evolution stone box um but like anything you know you have to get a large amount of it for it to be of use that's that's the way it goes for everything that's a raffle that's a um uh what do you call it like any of those gambling systems the more you have the higher chance you have of getting something of value and that's just the way it goes i mean we're getting all kinds of stuff but in the long run, it will help. Let's see if I can make the inventory actually bigger. No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. But I mean, we'll get there. We're getting stuff. We're down to 99 now. All right, let's keep on going. Let's keep the train going. Wish there was a quicker way to just quick use it, but I have not figured that out. So just got to keep on double clicking. Maybe if I push enter. Nope. Uh, lure balls, bunch of balls, potions, EV resets. Which, all this is in the long run, a Carbos. Okay, I'm not actually sure what Carbos is. Looks like it's another one of those things that you give your Pokemon to raise some stats. Um, 
Casino tokens. Great balls. Now, I have not yet gotten to the casino. But from what I'm understanding, the casino is where you go to catch... Uh, or not catch, but I mean, you can use casino tokens to get certain Pokemon and stuff like that. Another evolutional stone box. So I now have two evolutional stones coming out of this. Okay. Um, that in itself... And we're not... We're a little more than halfway through. So, I mean, that alone... Just saying that, I got the Pokemon box from it, one of them earlier. I did end up getting over 200, but I kind of messed up and opened some of them earlier. But I mean, I've got a Pokemon box. I've got Mystery Box. Not really sure what that's going to give me. I mean, that's a mystery. I've gotten six TM boxes now. Two Evolution, evolution Stone boxes. So we're going to get what you... In the long run, I'm going to get a lot of stuff out of here. There's a drop rate blessing. Uh, seven day GM ticket. Oh, look at that. I just got something good. That's another, that's another really good one. Um, what I, what would be really awesome is if I got the one year reset ticket. Oh my God. Could you imagine how big that would be? Whew. One year of GM for free. Just because I went and I grinded for hours and I did all this. Okay. Another seven day GM ticket. Do, 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 do. Down to 50. We're getting there. We're almost done with the Easter eggs, and then we get to open all the goodies. The real goodies. Great balls. Potions again. Alright, so let's see here. Do, 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 do. mystery box another mystery box i have two mystery boxes out of this i mean come on guys there was a lot of people crying and complaining during the event oh the easter eggs are useless uh really this is stuff these boxes and things are things that you sp that people spend real money for so what i'm literally doing here is basically i grinded and i got stuff that's worth actual money now you can't sell it for real money but you know, you basically got free money in game. And I'm sorry, but anytime you get free money, it's worth it. That that's that's literally the definition of a job. You work for money. Or for the equivalent of money. And that's literally what we did. We grinded, we worked, we got f these little uh things, and now we're getting money for it. Another world blessing. Level ball, poke balls, another level ball, potions, world blessing again, two potions, nine great balls, and the last one, four potions. Alrighty, next one's gonna be the Pokemon box. What do we get? Boom, a Flabibi, Flababe, Flababue. No idea what that is. Um, okay, so we got a flab flabebe. Um, I'm gonna look at that and figure out what that is. First, let's do the mystery box. Boom. Zinc, second mystery box. Boom. Five hyper potions. Alright, TM boxes. Let's see what we get TMs. False swipe. Giga drain. Hidden power. Skill swap. Sleep talk. Dream eater. Okay, and next one is Evolution Stone Boxes. Boom. A Sun Stone. And a Fire Stone. Alright, so let's go ahead and hit a quick little organize here. Yes, boom, we're going to organize our stuff. Okay, oh, that would help if I push the right button. Alright, so first things first, I like to put it so my actual Pokemon Balls are in the front. Okay. And the, the next one I do on that is I take the Pokeballs that are untradeable and I stick those in front of that one. But we don't have any of those. Then we do Great Balls. Then we'll do Ultra Balls, starting with the untradeables and then going with the other tradeables. Then the rest of them are all the special balls and I don't care. So, we got 25 Hyper Potions, 313 Potions. You did not get any Super Potions from it. Um, they're probably not in there, but Hyper Potions are more effective than those anyways. We got... One Calcium, one Carbos, two Proteins, three Zincs, Drop Rate Blessings, eight World Blessings. Um, we have 
three seven-day GM tickets, so I almost have a free month of GM status. I have a bike voucher. Uh, Firestone, Sunstone, Thunderstone. We got max revives and revives from killing people. We got a shiny stone somewhere in there from killing stuff. Bullet Seed, Hidden Power, Giga Drain, Sludge Bomb, Skill Swap, False Swipe, Swords Dance, Sleep Talk, and Dream Eater. That is my results from farming the Easter event, and that's just in the items. I almost got to a million um, of the currency. So that was essentially what we got out of all that. Oh, let's go over here real quick and go to item box. Okay, no, we don't need to do that. So let's see what this is. I don't have a clue what a Flabibi is. So we're going to look at this, okay? Flabibi uh, looks like a little flower with a, like a fairy on the top of it, I guess, would be a good at. Um, its ability is Flower Veil. Um, it's sassy, so it plus special defense at the cost of speed. That's probably not the preferred nature for this Flabibi. It's got some decent... IVs, I think. Really good special attack, really good attack, really good on speed. Special defense and defense is not too good. Um, I don't know. Like I said, I have no idea what this Pokemon is. Vine Whip and Tackle. That's actually a pretty strong plant move. And it's level 3. So this might be a giveaway. I might use it. We don't know. Pokemodex is 669. I only know up to 250. Like 251 actually, I think, to be honest. So this one's way out of my league. And... Uh, we will figure out what that's all worth later on. But thank you for watching, guys. This is Takahitsu from Takahitsu Gaming. I hope you've enjoyed what you've seen here. If you have, please hit a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you want to see more. And hit that bell icon for notifications. I hope you have a wonderful day. And good night. <laughs>